Circa 13,000 BC, Paleo Indian people began to inhabit the region. Circa 1000 AD, Native Americans began living in villages and create an agricultural society, supplemented with hunting, fishing, and harvesting other types of seafood. 1524, Captain Giovanni de Verrazzano, an Italian, explores the Mid Atlantic region. In 1608, Captain John Smith mapped the Chesapeake. On his map, he named a small isthmus Watkins Point, located just north of Fox Island, Virginia. 1620, the first account of a European trader with Native Americans in Somerset County. 1632, King Charles I of England grants the charter for the colony of Maryland to Cecil Calvert. On the eastern shore, King Charles formed the boundary between the Maryland and Virginia colonies at Watkins Point, running eastward to the Atlantic Ocean. 1634, Cecil's younger brother, Leonard Calvert, founds the settlement of St. Mary's. Virginia establishes Accomack Shire on the eastern shore but Maryland did not settle on the Eastern Shore for another 25 years. 1635 brings the first naval battle of the Chesapeake Bay, taking place in the Pocomoke Sound between vessels ordered by Governor Leonard Calvert to cease the trading operations of Captain William Claiborne, a Virginia Company official, the founder of Kent Island, and the first pirate of the Chesapeake Bay. 1655, Quakers, a Christian religious group, began to migrate to Accomack Shire. 1659, Virginia passes the anti-Quaker laws, requiring them to pay tithes to the Church of England or be prosecuted or even worse, executed. The Quakers began petitioning Lord Calvert for exile in the Maryland colony. 1661, Calvert began issuing land grants to the Quakers to establish a boundary between Maryland and Virginia from Watkins Point, east up the Pocomoke Sound, on Smith Island, and north up the Tanger Sound. In 1663, Colonel Edmund Scarborough, the leading opponent of the Quakers in the Accomack Shire, and who reportedly slaughtered 50 Native Americans of the Pocomoke tribe in 1651, leads 40 armed cavalrymen into the Big Animessex River area to force the Quakers to swear allegiance to Virginia. 1660s to 1700s is the age of tobacco. Tobacco is used as currency with court records showing that up to 500 pounds and more were used as payment. 